Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live, and you too can join the club at richpicksdaily.com where you can learn how to win and trade. Hey guys, how you doing? We got some big breaking news from Neo Battery Materials and BM in Canada. NBMFF in America, put on your radar, put on your watch list, huge breaking news exclusively here on Rich TV Live. Make sure you go and subscribe. Neo Battery Materials receives final site approval for land use of 106,700 square feet for NBM side commercial plant facility. Huge breaking news. Let's take a look, shall we? So this is the neobatterymaterials.com website. You can see the previous news on the website. And please feel free to go to neobatterymaterials.com. You can see on the top right, it says NBM on the Toronto Stock Venture Exchange and NBMFF on the OTCQB in America. And you can see all the previous news. So. Neo Battery Materials is extremely pleased to announce that the company has successfully received the final site approval by the province of Gyeonggi Do, or the province to construct the commercial plant facility of Neo's patented silicon anode materials, NBM side for electric vehicle lithium ion batteries. Huge, huge news. It's not even on the front page yet. If you click on news, you'll be able to see all of their biggest breaking news and news releases. And here it is right there. There it is. Neo Battery Materials receives final site approval for land use of 106,700 square feet for NBM side commercial plant facility by Gyeonggi Do, the largest economic province in South Korea. So huge, huge, huge news that you can find out right on the company website. You're also finding it right here on Rich TV Live where we bring you the news, we bring you great companies, and we bring it to you first. If you want to learn about Neo Battery Materials, you can find out right on their website. Now, let's just go through the news. Through Neo Battery Materials Korea Co. Limited, a wholly owned subsidiary of Neo, the company secured land and approximately an area of 106,000 700 square feet or 2.5 acres for the initial phase of the NBM side commercial plant facility. Neo initiated the site search in August of 2021 after the announcement of a strategic decision made to construct its silicon anode commercial plant in South Korea. After intensive research, communication, and negotiations with two provincial authorities, Neo has decided to apply to Gion Jidu, NBM Korea has qualified an extensive and strict due diligence process by the province's authorities and the Foreign Investment Review Board based on NEO's commercialization, timeline, viability, and economic impact of the business with regards to the current battery materials industry and its downstream products and various background reviews and stress tests. So you can learn more right here. And right on their website, you can see they are making a big shift in battery technology, pushing the step change in the electrical vehicle market with silicon anode materials. And you can see here, proprietary silicon technology. Neo silicon anode nano coating technology is absolutely game changing. Neo's benefited land is situated in an industrial complex known as a Seong International Foreign Investment Zone, otherwise known as Oseong Zone, in Fion Tech City, in which the land is designated solely for the use of foreign investment companies qualified by the province of Jianji. As a qualified company, NEO is entitled to several benefits and subsidies 
that will translate into both drastic cost savings in the short and long term for the anode material plant facility. The benefits include a 99% reduction of annual lease payments or a payment of 1% of the officially leased land value with a long-term base lease contract. And further to it, the annual lease payments can be immediately minimized to zero after the completion of the plant construction and fulfillment of requirements by the province. So you can learn more here right on the website about Neo batterymaterials.com. And like I said, this news is right on their website. You want to subscribe to the newsletter, feel free to subscribe to the newsletter and get all the information you need about the company right on the website. You want to learn about the directors and officers, just click on directors and officers, and it'll take you to directly to the management of the team. The maximum lease period for the land is 50 years. Now, this is also benefiting the stock today. You can see the stock is up 2% in Canada, currently at 36 cents and in our buy zone. You can see it's been as high as $1.29. We will mark that high, high zone with a circle. Oh, let's see if I can mark that high, high zone right there with a circle. So you can see the high of the zone is $1.29, which was on July 15th of 2021. So not that long ago, and it's done a downtrend, like a lot of small caps have done, to this lower level where I believe it is extremely undervalued, underappreciated, and underexposed. You can see the news is starting to circulate, and it is up 2.8% so far on the news. In America, the symbol is NBMFF, and you can see they're up 5% so far in America on the day. This is the daily chart. So you can see it is starting to trend up on the day in America and in Canada on the daily charts. If we just do the five day chart, you can see it's been kind of channeling higher over the last five days. And if we look at the last year, once again, you can see it's been as high as the dollar twenty nine right now. In my opinion, finding a bottom, and it's right in what I would call our buy zone that we have marked here on the chart. And based on this news, I think this could be a huge catalyst for the stock. Now, continuing with the news, the company may also access various tax incentives and active collaboration activities with the province to promote Neo's business in South Korea and overseas. Corporation tax, income tax land transfer tax, and customs taxes may be fully exempted for five years and may be reduced by 50% for an additional two years. Huge, huge, huge saving potential. NEO could also access provincial financial support for equipment purchases, employment subsidies, and education training subsidies. Now, what did the CEO have to say, Mr. Spencer? Huh? President and CEO of NEO said, and as you can see here, this is the management team right on the website. You can go to directors, officers, and advisors. And Spencer Hu, the president and CEO of NEO said, we are more than happy about the site approval. Our NEO and MBM Korea team have been eager and diligent to receive approval from the province of Gyeonggi for the past three months as this site in the foreign investment zone was the only remaining land apportioned for companies operating in the battery materials, materials industry. Despite our status as a micro small capitalization foreign company compared to existing sizable businesses in the Oseong zone, NEO was approved by Gyeonggi province and the foreign investment review board for the past two months. During the review and due diligence process, from the province, we had act actively held dialogue with the province's officials and representatives to respond and fulfill any requests for further investigation. We strongly believe that the province highly appreciated and held confidence in our clear roadmap of NEO's silicon anode NBM side commercialization plant. Now, if you go to the website, you can also see more information here about the company, including the share structure. 
share info, just click on share info and learn everything you need to know about the shares. You can see shares issued 97 million and fully diluted shares, 113 million shares fully diluted. You can see the chart right here on the website. You can click on timeline and you can see recent key developments. Now the MBM side commercialization plant along with our proprietary technology and our high managerial capacity accustomed to the lithium ion battery industry. Once again, we strongly believe that the province highly appreciated and held confidence in our clear roadmap, and this is the roadmap right here, guys, as you can see, of NEO's silicon anode NBM side commercialization plan, along with our proprietary technology and high managerial capacity accustomed to the lithium ion battery industry. We greatly thank Jian Ji Du for returning a decision for approval much faster than our expectation. This is huge news. Congratulations for Neo Battery Materials on getting this quick approval, much higher than the company's expectations. And we also thank our Neo team and our valued shareholders for the committed trust and patience, said, added Mr. Huh. Congratulations to all shareholders on Neo Battery Materials. This is a very, very, very big day for shareholders. Jianji's province. Oseong International Investment Zone is a complex type industrial park that captures 3.9 million square feet of land and houses foreign investment companies such as Korea Super Freeze Inc., a logistics business that retains a facility for COVID vaccine import and hydrogen fuel cell distribution. The Oseong Zone possesses exceptional infrastructure with geographic and supply chain advantages, be in proximity with large battery cell and automotive manufacturers. The province's officials have emphasized for the Oseong zone to become a center for green growth, attracting companies with transformative and cutting edge green technologies to be a part of the ecosystem. Mr. S.R. Huang, Chief Operating Officer of NEO commented, and once again, you can go to the company, Click on company. If you guys want to go and see the team, once again, just click on company and you can scroll down and you can go to where it says directors, officers, and advisors. And you can also click on scientific advisory board. Click on scientific advisory board. And you can see here, Dr. Sang Young Lee. And you can see Dr. Lee here, and then you can scroll down and see other members of the scientific advisory board, and including Mr. Wang. And Mr. Wang, Chief Operating Officer of NEO, commented, this site approval acts as a significant turning point and milestone for NEO to expedite our commercialization process for 2022 and beyond. This land holds sufficient area to accommodate the production capacity of 1,000 metric tons per year with future expansion. Huge, huge, huge potential growth. Now you can also go back here, go back on the website. All of this is here, guys, for you to review. And if you scroll up, you can see the boosting energy density and significant increasing battery life cycle of the neo silicon anode nanocoating technology which is absolutely game changing as silicon anode materials have been garnering a greater amount of attention from all points and players in the lithium ion battery value chain for electric vehicle applications the synergistic relationship between neo's performance advantages and low cost manufacturing processes is a particular interest to the counterparties. With current developments to commercial scale manufacturing, we are on track and are confident to increase 
the silicon loading in the anode material for boosting the energy density and lifespan of state-of-the-art lithium ion batteries. Game changing, Mr. Ho finally remarked. NEO and MBM Korea will proceed with a long term lease contract with Jion Jidu immediately and move forward to the next process of construction. The commercial plant facility, as always announced, huge, huge, huge. Now, I must remind you guys that Rich TV Live is strictly for information and education purposes. You can go to richpigsdaily.com and scroll to the top right and go to chats. We've got an NBM chat for Neo Battery Materials. All you got to do is click on it and join the chat where you can earn free rewards and talk to other shareholders and members of the Rich TV Live community that are talking about this news right now. It's true. Once again, here's the price now at 37 cents and up 4% in Canada on the day on this news. And once again, you can take a look at the Neo Silicon Anno, Anode Nano Coating Technology. And once again, Neo will update additional corporate and construction development activities shortly. This is directly from, directly from the words of Mr. S. R. Wang, Chief Operating Officer of Neo. So what do you guys think of this news? If you like this news, please smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere, and subscribe. What do you think of the big news, the big shift in battery technology happening with Neo battery materials? Absolutely game-changing. And I think it's important that everybody's aware of this news and a little bit about the province of Jion G. So... This news continues with some information about the province of Jianji or Jianji Du is the most populous 13.4 million people and houses the largest provincial government in Korea. The province surrounds Seoul, the capital of South Korea. Jianji Du is also known as the hub of industries and as the regional economy in Korea with the number one international trade volume of USD 141.8 billion in 2019. That's right, billion with a B, among all other provinces. Jianji Du is home to world-renowned companies such as Samsung, Hyundai, LG, Kia, SK, Hynix, and multinational global companies such as 3M, Bosch, and Siemens. The province especially is a main cluster of the battery supply chain in Korea, including the home of Samsung SDI, which takes the position as one of the global top five battery makers. Now, a little bit of information on Neo Battery Materials. And if you guys would like to contact the company, you just click on contact and feel free to contact the company directly with any questions, concerns you may have, feel free to just go directly to the company. All right, and you wanna learn about their technology, you can click on technology right here on the website. And if you click on technology, it also takes you directly to learn more about their technology. All right. Now, to continue a little bit about Neo Battery Materials Limited, Neo Battery Materials is a Vancouver based company focused on battery materials and metals. And Neo has a focus on producing silicon anode materials through its proprietary single step nano coating process. Now, you can also scroll down here on the website and where they talk a little bit about it. And you can scroll down a little bit more. And you can see a little bit more information about their single step nano coating process, which provides improvements in capacity and efficiency over lithium ion batteries using graphite in their anode materials. The company intends to become a silicon anode active material supplier to the electric vehicle industry. For more information, please visit the company at its website 
which we're on at neobatterymaterials.com. Let me know what you think of this video. If you like the video, please let me know. Comment on the video. This is Rich from Rich TV Live. If you're not winning, probably not watching. We bring you the winners and we bring them to you first. Love to know what you guys think about this news. All right, guys, so what do you think about this news? I think it's big breaking news, huge news, game-changing news for Neo Battery Materials, NBM in Canada, NBMFF in America. Absolutely game-changing. What do you guys think? I think this could be an absolute amazing entry point for early stage investors in Neo battery materials. And I think everybody needs to put them on their radar and on their watch list. Absolutely game-changing news. Once again, the big news, Neo battery materials receives final site approval for land use of 106,700 square feet for NBM side commercial plant facility. What do you think of the news? We're breaking it first exclusively with your boy Rich from Rich TV Live and Rich Picks Daily, where you should go and join the club, join our chat. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you're not winning, probably not watching, we bring you the winners and we bring them to you first. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Your boy's out.